It's taken thousands of volunteer hours and it's brought the tight knit community of Quadra Island even closer together. The Taste of Life on Quadra Island cookbook is raising money for a good cause. And as Tess Van Stratton shows us in this week's Vital People, it's already making a big difference. Chop a few of that. It's a really nice uh, bok choy. Cooking is a passion for many people on Quadra Island. I've got some sugar snaps. They'll be nice and fresh. And Heather Simpson is no exception. I love good food, and I think cooking is definitely a way of bringing people together. And that passion for food has brought the island together with this cookbook, A Taste of Life on Quadra Island. It was an absolutely major volunteer undertaking and we had artists and chefs and home bakers, photographers, writers and artisans. Thousands of volunteer hours went into this beautiful book, including more than 80 cooks testing 350 recipes Islanders submitted. 21 writers contributed history tales and gardening and foraging tips and 22 photographers donated their time. It was challenging and, and uh, a lot of work, but it was, it was fun to, to try and make the food come alive. The cookbook's a fundraiser for the Quadra Children's Centre, which has been helping island families since 1996, and thousands of copies have already been sold. The fundraiser has been absolutely fantastic, beyond words. Uh, it has allowed us to provide so many things that we would have probably struggled to provide in the past uh, as a nonprofit organization. It's been really great to have the pressure taken off of um, watching financially every little bit of what we're doing and, and it's given us some freedom to, you know, really focus on strengthening the programs. I love this recipe because it's got so much fresh stuff in it. For Heather, whose children went to the center more than 30 years ago, the fundraiser is a way to give back and help with some much needed repairs. And it's just so near and dear to our hearts and for everybody on the island, it's really the heart of the community. You know, when you saw that end result, it was like, wow, this is, this is a, a great accomplishment. And it's an accomplishment that showcases how important community is on Quadra Island. As a small community, um, to have a group of people come together uh, on a project of this size and impact. When I think about the time and the energy and the love that has been put into this, this project, it's, it's absolutely beautiful.